morning to all of you. Mama, I have hope you don't have to be in the hotel. Why is it that you don't have to be in the hotel? You don't have to be in the hotel. Amen. Amen. Thank you for all. Today, you will serve us as a temple. What you want to have to go? What do you go? Jesus knows me. Amen? Amen. 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 In John chapter 4, we can see a woman whose life was full of hardship. She is very different from Nicodem in many aspects. First, it was their race. Nicodem was a Jew whom people admired, but the woman was a Samaritan whom people neglected at the time. Number four. Yes, four. Next. Second, it is their social status. Nicodem was a Parisian um, influence politician while the woman did not get any social recognition. Jesus met the socially unvalued woman in the mind as of all Jesus teaching in Matthew chapter 9, 30 B. For I came not to call the righteous but sinner. People love to be served, not to suffer. Also, they see social recognition. However, Jesus went out and met those who need his serving, care, and help. Him. Next. So, it was Jesus' different reaction. Jesus told Nicodemus to be born again. However, Jesus told the Samaritan woman to give her the living water to remove her thirsty forever. Yeah. Mm. Amen. Next. We can Jesus radical reaction to different people. And for Jesus radical reaction to different people. For example, Jesus rebuked the Pharisees and the Sadducees. Then he told the rich young man to shed all his rest and give to the poor. Jesus encouraged judge, <coughs> Jesus encouraged Zacchaeus by saying, I must at your home, your house today. Jesus healed the, the blood beggar, the body mayo, after saying, you are has had made you well. When people caught the other dress woman, Jesus did not judge her. He said he told her, <coughs> Dear, do I condemn you? Go and from now on sin no more. I think we have to Jesus showed different reaction, such as comforting, encouragement, or reproof to preach the gospel according to the need of his listener, like Jesus. 
we should approach people to preach the gospel according to this context. That is your goal? Yes. Yes. Amen. Jesus met me without fire. The Pharisees heard Jesus baptized more disciples than John the Baptist. Jesus also knew that the Pharisees heard, heard it. Then Jesus left the Judea and went to the Galilee again. On the way from Judea to Galilee, Jesus went through Samaria. Jesus went to the sea of how is Samaria. He was near the land Jacob's gave to Joseph, so that Joseph Jacob's well was in Sakar, Sikar. Jesus go higher. So he took a last of Jacob's well. It was around 12 noon. Then he met a woman there. Next. After leading this part, I have two wide questions. Number one, why? Why did Jesus leave Judea and go to Galilee again? That because Jesus acknowledged the jealous of the of the Jew about his baptism, the Jew felt jealous and angry when Jesus baptized more disciples than John the Baptist. He showed humans are sensitive to number. The number is related to their achievement, but Jesus was not interested in the secular competition in terms of number. Thus he left Judea and went to Galilee through Samaria. Next. Number two, why? Why did Jesus pass through Samaria on the way from Judea to Galilee? Galilee. Passing through Samaria was the shortcut to go from Judea, Judea to Galilee then. Nevertheless, no Jew wanted to go to Samaria. Then, Jew and Samaritan were one less, but the Jew disagreed with it. That's because of their history, the Jew valued the poor bloodline, but Samaritan many the Gentile invaders and accept the Gentile tra tradition. They also had religious companies with the Samaritan. Next. <coughs> Thus, the Jews were shame of the Samaritan and neglected them. However, Intentionally, Jesus passed through Samaria. Moreover, I told you that the Jews neglected the Samaritan, sadly, among 
Samaritans or avoid one woman, however, unlike other people. Jesus did not avoid her. Jesus, the Son of the Most High God, came to her and treated her with dignity. It is consistent with Jesus' teaching, like his teaching, Jesus came to search or for the loss of saving them. Amen. Amen. Jesus came to search for the lost and saved them. Thus, he appreciated the woman, regardless of social, religious, and historical barriers, he was hope of the lost. Next. You title what do they go? Amen. 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 Yes, Lord. Accept Jesus. Amen. 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 Yes. It was a twelve noon. How hot would be would it be? But thus no one way outside at the at the at the time Jesus and his disciples would be very tired and thirsty as they traveled through Samaria. But thus Jesus took a rest at Jacob's well. Usually people get water from the well in the morning or evening. Anyway, Jesus saw a woman. It was 12 noon. It was, it was very hot. There was no one except the woman and Jesus. The woman came to Jacob's well to get water. At the time, Jesus' disciples went to the town to buy something to eat. Jesus said to her, Jesus said to her, Give me drink. She, said, she answered, How it is that you, a Jew, ask for a drink from me, a woman of Samaria? At the time, the Jew never interested with the Samaritans, thus she could not understand Jesus. Next. The woman, the woman would get used to social legality to live without hope. She would not want to meet her neighbors. Thus, she came to the wheel on noon when no one came. She would get shocked when Jesus talked to her. She questioned why Jesus cast a dig from her. In her context, that means men to never talk to the social neglected Samaritan woman. Unlike others, Jesus seemed to have no interest in how much others neglected the woman. Jesus appreciated the woman to tell her the kingdom gospel not treat buyers on the prevalent social bias. Everyone needs to gospel. Amen? Amen. <laughs> Therefore, like Jesus, we also should preach the gospel to all the people regardless of their social status. Next. The 
woman got shocked when Jesus talked to her, not neglected her. But it was not the end of the story, her story. She was brave enough to ask Jesus why he approached her. Later, she would accept Jesus when she understands the kingdom gospel. Amen. Amen. Like her, we also should ask Jesus when he came, he comes to us with the truth. That we should accept the true Jesus, it is the true wisdom and courage. Amen. 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 Next. Next. Jesus. Jesus knows everyone's struggle and approach people to preach the gospel according to the listener context. Amen. Amen. Next. Number two. Jesus approached the neglected people without any bias if they need Jesus. Amen. Next. We need wisdom and courage to accept Jesus Christ as our Savior and Lord. Amen. 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 Let's pray. Lord. You know all our struggle and situation. Thank you for coming to us and you value our dignity. Help us have the wisdom and the courage to preach the gospel according to the listener context as Jesus did and accept the Lord sincerely. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.